Patty didn't have a lot of money. She had that one white shirt, and it wasn't a big deal. She had her voice and her hair, her way of leaning against a wall, and her way of looking at you, like you were the cigarette and she was going to smoke you. I know she lives in New York now, and sometimes I think about hanging around her block until she notices me, but I wouldn't want to scare her. But it's more like I want to just build a time machine and go back and meet her when she is 19. And maybe we could have an affair. And maybe I could just go back to her house and touch everything that she owns to get her magic on my skin. For now, I'm just going to imagine it's the 60s. It's the 60s and I'm famous somehow. Everyone wants to get a hold of me. My makeup is always perfect, even when I wake up in the morning. Dramatic things are happening all around me. I barely react. When I leave the house, I dodge the paparazzi. I have some sunglasses on, you know, but everything's all on black and white. This is the thing about moving backwards and forwards in time. When I stand like this, I look like Patti Smith at Hermosa Blind. If I kiss you like this, it's like I am Joe Strummer in 1977, and you snuck backstage to meet me, and your dreams just came true. If I give you a look like this, then maybe you would do anything for me. You would rob a bank for me. If I stand like this, or I look at you like this, or if I kiss you like this, then I'm me. I'm your Theodora, and everything snaps into color. Thank you.